We like sports and we don't care who knows From shooting hoops to the Super Bowl Just two normal guys hanging out having fun Right guy number two? Yeah, guy number one Watching sports with girls is a pain They don't know the rules, there's no time to explain Throw me the baseball Now toss me the big skin Now feed me the rock Now give me the rock Yeah, it leads with his Now is that helmet the helmet or not? Yeah, you kind of wonder about the player safety with, you know, the NFL and, the, you know, the, the concussions and the, the caring for that and the process that it takes. No helmet and just going in. That was a big hit. Yeah. Just, what is he doing? Ball carrier, helmet comes off, plays over. Mm -hmm. Anybody else? Play continues. I did. Helmet to hair, I guess, is okay. Ugh. Welcome to the Weekly Sports Report in 2012. How about Number them one. apples? This is Keele. This is Bill K. This okay. is... How it's going to go down, mm -hmm. National Football League playoffs. Mm -hmm. Finally settled after a crazy season from is it even going to start to <laughs> going down to the last week here, which is yeah. what you want to see as an NFL fan. Finally wrapped up here, week 17. Uh, Raiders, Raiders still missing the boat. Uh, can they still have that commitment to excellence? Please, come on. Can we just take that down? Two thousand two. Actually, do something. Two thousand two was their last playoff run. Yes, yeah, they took yeah. that to the Super Bowl and, and lost. <laughs> but it's like, guys, yeah. come on, get back there. Mm -hmm. Hugh Jackson looking silly, especially with that Carson Palmer trade now because they got the quarterback that was going to bring them to the playoffs. Oh, oh darn! Not only did you not go to the playoffs, the team that you gave like your next two drafts to is in the playoffs yeah. right now. Uh -huh. As a Browns fan, thanks a lot, Hugh Jackson. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Carson Palmer could have been one of the red-haired quarterbacks going in. Instead, that is given to Andy Dalton, who, rookie quarterback coming out of TCU, looking kind of weird with the cute girlfriend, and then all of a sudden, sure, yeah, I'll, I'll take the Bengals to the playoffs. <laughs> they were supposed to be the throwaway team for, yeah. oh boy, getting rid of Ocho oh, Cinco, right. Palmer, oh, you know, I'm, I'd rather retire if I have to play it. That whole mess, and then you start the rookie quarterback? Yeah. Playoffs? 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 Don't talk about it. Playoffs? No playoffs in Tennessee, though. Ironic, because Cincinnati loses, Denver loses, Tennessee wins. Wait a minute. Huh. Why is Denver and Cincinnati in the playoffs? But ten, 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 uh, hmm. It's not fair sometimes. No. Oh, no. Well, sorry, Matt. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And uh, not fair especially because you're going to have some unemployment for some people coming up here. Uh, Spagnolio from the... Well, let's call him SpaghettiOs from now on. SpaghettiOs uh -oh. with that. Oh, Spadudios. He's gone. Yep. And uh, even the remnants of the Rams, Mike Martz, offensive coordinator in Chai Town. Bye he gone. He gone. Uh, Raheem Momo Morris. Uh, After two years. Apparently gone. he up and neared it. Mm -hmm. And I, you know, he's gone now, which, you know, he had that one good season. You think he's building them. In. Bye? Really? A ten game losing streak will do that Ooh, to you. Four oh and two at one point this year. Oh, boy. Oh and boy. then the, uh, the Bears GM. Angelo. Angelo, he gone. Angelo, go. And the Colts, the Polians. <laughs> Do you want ketchup on your Polian hot dog? No? On? Wow. No? After Manning's one. like, what? Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm shocked. You lose the quarterback of your defense and the quarterback of your offense in the first week. Really? Yeah. <laughs> You're yeah. Gonna, I, I don't know. I just have a problem with that. And it's not like Andrew Luck's not excited to go there. He was even interviewed yeah, yesterday yeah. During, after the bowl game. And was like, so, going to the Colts, you're pretty excited? Eh, if that's what happens, cool, I'm sure I'll just make the most of it. It's like, wow. please don't give me another Eli. Wow. <laughs> that, that eerily uh, reminds me of a story of a little quarterback coming out of Stanford mm -hmm. who kind of didn't want to play for the Colts. Uh, might have heard of him, John Elway. What is this lineage of Stanford <laughs> quarterbacks? That maybe Jim Plunkett didn't want to play for the Baltimore Colts. Either, and, yeah. and, oh, they don't well, like horseshoes, I yeah, guess. I, I, don't I, know I, I, you know, I don't know. Whatever. So, uh, you know, college bowls now, it's it's going down, mm -hmm. buddy. Uh, mm -hmm. You get a, a, a whole list here. So, you know, let, let's get well, down to predictions. Let's say this really quick. <laughs> Obviously, no defense played by the Pac-12. You could say that. Wow. You could say that. And the Stanford kicker. Oh, golly. Icy stares of death Poor coming Wilson. from that. You know, a freshman, I get it. Huge Twice. comma, but Twice. you gotta make them kicks, buddy. I didn't see the second one, but the first one was so wide off. I think I got hit in the head. Yeah, with it. It, yeah. Oh, that yeah. poor kid. That was a stray. Poor, poor kid. That was a stray. Uh, you know, so we'll have, you know, the, the BCS games coming up here. Mm -hmm. And uh, we'll just, you know, tear through them and let's just... Boom, boom, okay? All right, Michigan, Virginia Tech. 
Wolverines? Michigan. Ooh, okay, right. okay. Uh, Clemson, West Virginia? Clemson. Clemson? Yeah, I'll, go, I'll go West Virginia. No, I'll go West Virginia on that. Uh -huh, K-State uh -huh. and Arkansas. Ooh, Arkansas. Ooh, you're going to go Arkansas? I'm going to go the Wicked Wicked Wildcats. Well, I'm going Kansas State, too. I just mispronounced it. Oh, I just, oh, oh. K-State, well, I'm there you go. purple, man. There you go. Oh, okay, boy. and the, uh, the kind of championship game that I guess we should mention. We saw this game before, I yes, think. Yes, we did. Uh, LSU six. and Bama. <sighs> And he got Tyran Matthew, Honey Badger's gonna get it done. Right. Right. Seven to six. That's ooh, my prediction ooh. there. I'm gonna say the bull team's getting to the double digits here. Really? Oh, shocking. Are you kidding me? Shocking. I'm gonna go like a 17-14. Finally comes down to the field goal that, you know, <laughs> not that that already happened, but I'm gonna say After how many I'm gonna say field Bama. Goals. I'm gonna say Bama wins we'll that. We have a little bit more to play for. Roll tide. So we'll Sean roll, Alexander Lopez. Roll tide. Roll tide. All right. Um and the, the NFL season, the Huskies are wrap it up. Mm -hmm. uh, Hawks, Hawks wrap it up. <laughs> too many H's, too many... Yeah. Uh, Pull yourself boom. off there. Starting off this New Year grade. Yes, <laughs> okay. Super. I like you threw up right <laughs> Who wants chowder? <laughs> Hawks wrapping it up, play, kind of a, not, not, not the greatest way to go out, losing no. to the Cardinals in overtime. One of four teams to do that this year, yeah. by the way. At least yeah. Patrick Peterson didn't burn us. But, yeah. I, you know, just it's, it's kind of a bummer way to go out. Of yeah, yeah, you know, overtime loss, and, you know, I, I get it and still want to compete. But, mm -hmm. you know, kind of, you know, the flip side of that, that kind of puts us in a better drafting spot to get a quarterback because now we're sitting at, I think, 11 or 12, yep. depending on the coin. <laughs> Does it still come down to the coin flip? I mean, that just seems so barbaric. There like, just so many ways. Coin flip. So many like, ways. Can't it come down break. to like the stats or the the more? It just settle on something. The, the the backyard school, the, the coin flip. Yeah. That's the recess rules. Mm -hmm. This is the NFL. I you know I, I guess so. This wops. So, this wops. Kind of puts us in a better position because we're not going to get Robert Griffin or yeah. you know like Andrew Luck. That's going to be tough. But uh, Matt. Flynn. Uh-huh. Uh, veteran, right. get him in there, young. He's Ready gonna right him. now. <laughs> Woo! Get him, get him, get him. Yes. Uh, Speaking of getting him, the Huskies have gotten themselves a new couple of hymns. Very much. They were the only ten I see. <laughs> Excuse me, are you from Tennessee? Because you're the only ten I see. So you got the defensive coordinator coming over. Yep, you got Justin the Wilcox. linebackers coach Peter, coming over he'll there. give you a sermon. Mm -hmm. Who coached in 2008 at Central. Wow. Repping the alum. Wow. One year, and then he got the hell out of Helensburg. Yeah. <laughs> so, you know, I, he can't no blame him. Can't blame him for that. And I believe, too, a Walla Walla native. So he's, he's at least from the state. So, he came back. You know, although it's a pair of ducks that we're bringing in. As a Huskies fan, you never... But you know. we're taking talented people and not letting them go back to Oregon. Yeah. We're taking them yeah. from him. That's how I choose to look at yeah. it. Which, Otherwise, I'm pretty sick Which credit to the Huskies because, you know, this was a pretty prompt firing of Holt, which, you know, mm -hmm. I, I kind of believe we're calling it because we're like, he's got to be on the hot seat. got to be on the hot seat. Like, if you bring him back for a year, that's got to be his hot ass seat. ass was on fire if he Boom. came back. Okay. He, you know, his, his glasses were probably all steamed up, but taken but care of. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, uh, and so now, you know, we hurry up and find coordinate. This wasn't a lengthy process. This mm -hmm. wasn't, who the Huskies hit? Who the Huskies hit? This is pretty soon as I got the news of, oh, Holt's gone. Who are these Tennessee guys? So yeah. I like this Swift. I like this. Holt fired. It, pow, new yeah. guy. Right in the kisser. Okay. Pow! Are you saying pow? Pow, right in the kisser. But you have to hope that you give them sort of like a year or two leniency. Yeah, because it's almost, because Holt got three... Yeah. That almost seemed like way too much, especially getting progressively worse. That was now, the problem. Uh, now if he got, you know, maybe like three quarters of a hold in it, improvement, improvement. Yeah. And, you know, he's got a very, very low bar to hop over, considering uh -huh. that Alamo Bowl game. He has to dig the to get yards. to the bar right now. And the yards, yeah. yeah well, mm -hmm. UW basketball played themselves a little defense, though, they right? Did. You were they in the building did. for this. How about them apples? Yes. What have we been saying? The defense leads to the offense. Mm -hmm. We are run, 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 run to that team. Boom, block, catch it, boom, pass, done. That's what you do. Yep. We're not dribble up to the half court. One, one, one. And then people run around, it's kind of hands on hips. Going, I mean, I could have hit a three if you want to pass me. But, oh, yeah, oh, 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 no, I did Oh, darn right. it, you guys. Just put it that way. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, you know, one of the more complete defensive games that I've seen them play versus Oregon. We called it, they maybe go one and one versus the Oregon yes, schools. Yes, they were wrong. They, they got off the sweep and broom. So, I'm glad because you know, this is starting up in conference play. Mm -hmm. Pac 12 looking pretty weak all across Horrible. the board. There's not even that one like, well, you know, that's going to be the team to beat. I don't even feel there not is like us. a team to beat in no. the Pac-12. Because it's kind of like we're 
so up and down that it, it, it's hard to kind of predict for you know who the the go to guys are. So if we can sort of go for the jugular in this conference and really take control, oh. I think that'll be really beneficial getting into the March Madness Protect. tourney. Protecting home court is vital, and we mm -hmm. have done that this first weekend, mm -hmm. so that is very nice to see. And i got to give props to Aziz. Good God, yeah. where did the offense come yeah. from from this guy? Uh -huh. little... I know we talk about defense a lot, but his offense was non-existent. We didn't expect anything from him. I think I actually witnessed him score eight points Yeah, in yeah. just the half that I watched. I was astounded. I was yeah, so yeah. He, for him. he's been working on his little turnaround jumpers. He's never going to do the elbow in jump shot. You know, mm -hmm. that, that's not his game, but that's you know, he, he's in there. He, he's going to get you about three, four, five blocks a game. He's going to get you maybe six or seven points. That's all we want Henry from bounce. our big guy, but we need him in the game. I mean, big yes. time. Um, so, you know, predictions for them, they're going to go UW and uh, Colorado and Utah kind of Traveling playing there. that. And if you saw the Utah score, oh my it gosh. wasn't a bowl game. <laughs> 33 points? Colorado took them Bowsers. apart. Bowsers. Bowsers. They've got three wins this year. Colorado, though, they're, watch out for them. They've got like 10 wins, so they're, they're doing all right. Uh -huh. uh, we're on the road, so again, I think I think they'll get the Utah game. Okay, yeah. Get the Utah like, game. yeah. I think Colorado might get them just because, you know, they don't seem one in four in a okay. row. That's okay. my feeling. So we're, we're still going to call out the one and one and, you know, hey, if Sounds we keep like doing that every yeah. week and then they go 2-0, oh, no. cool let's go one and one every week. Mm -hmm. huh? Roll our season go, no, no, we, we go 2-0. Oh, you shut your mouth. <laughs> shut your mouth. <laughs> you shut your mouth when you're talking to me. It's someone Wait, shut your mouth. Shut, shut, your, shut your mouth. I'm sorry? NFL playoffs now. Mm -hmm. Let's get this started with the Saints hosting the Lions. I'm going to go Saints because the Lions still are far too young. Yeah, as as yeah. Still, immature. Still young, and, you know, you can't expect a Jim Schwartz handshake at the end of the <laughs> game or else he'll run alongside you for, hey, what was that? What was that? What was that? What was that back there? Uh, so, you know, it, it, I'm going to go Lions, sort of the feel-good story. Right. If they can just get one playoff win, then, you know, then it's not two years in a row where the Saints are supposed to, all right, you know, sure. here we did because, you know, Beast Mode, the Seahawks weren't supposed to have a chance against defending here, Super Bowl champions. So, you know, I'm going to say Lions, feel-good story. Falcons and, and Giants. And it's I, in New York. Okay, but the Seahawks came into New York, and so... I really almost don't buy that, but, you know, they did beat the Cowboys when they had to because that was a pressure game. Yeah, Yet again, we go back to the Tony Romo. Is he the guy in Dallas, or sure. does he get another year of good? So, you know, I, you know I'm going to go Giants. I'm just going to go the G there. Right here. I'm going to go Dirty Birds. I think they're going to win that one. Tebow okay. hosting the Steelers. Uh, Run no Ryan Clark because mm -hmm. he can't play with the sickle yeah. cell. No Richard Mendenhall. I'm going to go Steelers anyway. You still I have to win by a Steelers. That, that defense is just going to swarm them. Uh, got my Tebow right here. Mm -hmm. All I need is my teacup. Mm -hmm. That's something that interests yeah. the Steelers, my friend. <laughs> got my teacup here. Now all I need is a tea bag. That's something that interests you, my friend. <laughs> I just, you know, the the play, the, the Pittsburgh in the play, playoff, play, 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 play. <laughs> Pittsburgh in the playoffs. There you go. They. Too many P's. No, JPP. What's going down? They have a little bit of experience in it. Plus, how many of those core guys have still been there? I mean, you have the one where they like first won it, and it's like, all right, yeah, they're still gelled together. There you go. It's gonna come together in the playoffs. So they'll rip apart the Broncos. Houston hosting Cincinnati. Oh wow! The Bengals, the stripes, the, the Tigers are gonna get done. You, you got to, and the seventeenth quarterback on the depth chart here with the Texans. Same they're gonna have to get it done. Too. Which you know, I like them. The Texans, they're my little adopted mm -hmm. orphan team because they're not the Cowboys. They're that other little team in Texas that people don't really know about. So, I want to say Houston. But you just can't? I, I just can't. Huh? I just can't. Victory formation. Let's get to it. Thank you, Brad Jones. <laughs> Who? Brad Jones. Who? Brad Jones. Oh, yeah. Brad Jones. For tackling fans, don't run on the field. It's a total waste of time. Just, just let it happen. Here's the, here's the video. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. Mm. Serena Williams, you better find your passion, okay? Uh, she's just like, I, I don't know. I don't even know how I became an athlete. Really. I mean, I, I, I'd rather almost be shopping. I, you know, you can't, you can't say that now after X amount of, you know, tennis tournaments you've won. Just, I don't know, I'm not really feeling it today. No, you better start mm. feeling it because there are some very mad people going, how do you just lean over and keep accepting the checks if you don't even want to be earning them? I forward them to buy a dress, please. 
for the weekly sports board. I'm Keith Ladies, Bill Gay. We is out!